In this video, I'm going to be showing how we can play a Commodore 64 game on your Android device. Uh, the game I'm going to use, for example, is the game that I've created called Crystal Caverns. Uh, we're watching a short video clip of it now. But what we're going to do is we're going to download the D64 image file, which is basically a floppy disk in, an Im in a file format that we can use in an emulator. So let's go ahead and download that real quick. Okay, so now that we've gotten the game downloaded that we're wanting to play, we're going to need to use an emulator. An emulator is a program that allows uh, you to emulate a different machine. So we're going to need a Commodore 64 emulator. There's a bunch of Commodore 64 emulators available, but the one that I like the best for playing games on an Android device is called Vice C64. So let's go ahead and install it. Okay, let's go ahead and open this up. So now we're setting at a Commodore 64 boot screen. I'll show you a few things about the simulator that I really like and part of the reason why I like it for playing games. It has a touchscreen joystick already built in that you don't need to configure. I'll show you right here. You see we can just move our finger around and it moves the joystick to the correct locations. So you can just play with your thumb or your finger and control the joystick right there on screen without any configuration. Your fire button is this A in the bottom uh, right hand corner. Now let's go ahead and load an image file. We've downloaded one earlier. Unless you've used a file management program or you downloaded it somewhere differently, it's going to be in your downloads folder. Let me show you how to do that. We're going to hit the back button on your device. Then we're going to select our drive 8. We need to navigate to the root location. Go to our download folder. Right here we can see we have the Crystal Caverns image that we downloaded. So let's go ahead and click on it or say OK. And then there's a nice feature of we can hit Run. Say OK. We don't even have to type a command or anything. The game automatically loads. And now we're playing a Commodore 64 game on an Android device. I'm not very good at it while trying to film and talk at the same time, but you can see it works pretty well. Uh, a couple other things about the simulator I'll go over real quick. If you see in the top left hand corner of the screen there's a little button. If you press that, what that does is that brings up an on-screen keyboard, just for if the game requires keyboard input for putting in a character name or a function in the game, you can bring that up very easily. You press it again, it'll go away. And also, if we go back to the disk loading screen, you see this button in the top right-hand corner it says Get Games and Demos. What this does is this takes you to uh, c64.com, which has a huge database of Commodore games and you can download these image files exactly the same as we downloaded my game earlier and you can check out a whole bunch of Commodore games that are available to play so that's it for showing how to play Commodore games on an Android device I hope this was helpful if you found this interesting and want to keep seeing content like this please consider subscribing to my channel thank you very much for watching and have a great day